Hello everyone, today, we are going to talk about stock item matrix. It commonly used to organize the coding requirement to generate the item code. For example, this setting can be done to generate the t-shirt code with different sizes and colors. Let's start. Click on stock, then maintain stock item matrix profile. Okay, now I am going to go through the setting with you one by one. Code is your item matrix profile code. Example shirt or shoe. Look at the example here. System can help generate the item code as the format of shirt. Blue. XL it is based on your setting on prefix, dimension and separator. Length of the matrix setting is based on the length of the wording. For example, shirt is 1 to 5, shoe is 1 to 4 only. Give you more examples here. Shirt is 1 to 5, separator is 6, blue is 7 to 10, separator 11, and XL is 12 to 13. Another example, shoe is 1 to 4, separator is 5, yellow is 6 to 9, separator 10, and 37 is 11 to 12. Now we can start to do one item matrix. Key and shirt for the code and description. Then my prefix, shirt is 5 alphabets, so I put in 1 to 5. Dimension for row I want to put in my color with 4 alphabets, 7 to 10. Dimension for column I want to put in my size and just one alphabet, so as 12 to 12. My separator remains dash. Now we need to add in my color in the dimension for row. I got four types of color. Blue. Yellow. Black. And white. For column dimension, I want to do setting for sizes, small, medium, and large. Save. Like this a stock item matrix profile is done. Now, we can generate the item code. Go to stock, maintain stock item. Right click, generate stock item. Choose your matrix profile, choose the shirt. Prefix here I want to put my brand mango. Then, choose the stock group. Then, click OK then system will generate all the item code. And all this is your item code. Thank you. Subscribe to our YouTube for the latest video. Follow our Facebook for the latest update. Go to our website for reports and guides. It's so easy.